We are now leaving Chongqing behind us, bound for Xi'an, via high-speed train, travelling up to a speed of 309 kilometers an hour. We have just arrived Xi'an by train terminal for our tour of Xi'an. We are just checking into a hotel in Xi'an. Our tour will start tomorrow with the Terracotta Warrior. Really looking forward to it. The next morning, we started our tour by visiting the famous Terracotta Warrior Museum. The warriors were built by the first emperor of China, Qin Shi Huang, to protect him in his afterlife. Over 8,000 life-size warriors, horses and chariots were buried for more than 2,000 years before it was discovered by local farmer in 1974. This is the lunch provided at the local hot spring hotel. After lunch, our local guide brought us to visit the Muslim Quarter, which is the hub of the Muslim community in Xi'an city. The Muslim market located here is a great place to sample the local Muslim community cuisine. What are you having? Cut the fish. <laughs> What are you having? Huang Hui Chi Which is English persimmon cake.
After the Muslim quarter, we took a stroll on the ancient city wall, the largest and best preserved ancient city wall in China. The wall is 12 meters high and 18 meters wide with a radius of nearly 14 kilometers. In the evening, we went to the Tang Palace Dumpling Dinner and Dance Show. The dance and music show is based on the life of the famous Empress of the Great Tang Dynasty, Empress Wu Zi Tian. The show with the aid of stunning visual effects and the talented dancers and orchestra really brought the glory and the splendor of the Tang Dynasty to life. The next day, we ended our tour of Xi'an by exploring the Big Wild Goose Pagoda. The pagoda rising to a height of 64.5 meters was built by the famous Buddhist master Swan Sang and was built to preserve the classic scriptures that he brought back from India during the early Tang Dynasty. The top of the pagoda provided a 360 degrees view of the city of Xi'an. Xi'an is a city that retains much of its ancient charm. Within the ancient city wall, the buildings are not allowed to be higher than the wall and must meet certain design criteria to blend in with the city ancient charm. We also really enjoyed the well-known terracotta warriors. We were really amazed with the details of each of the warriors that was restored. They have their own unique facial expressions and body build and postures.
I hope you enjoyed this video of mine. Please give it a like and if you have not done so, please subscribe to my channel now to receive updates of new videos I've uploaded. Thank you.